342, eight homers, 28 runs batted in. Very back of that right-handed batter's box. There's a bouncer towards third. Nice play over there by Horvath. They're six and four in the ACC. There's a chopper towards first on a slow breaking pitch. And the first baseman over there. Pitch on the way. There's a chopper towards third. Routine over there for Horvath. Throws him out by a couple of steps. It's comfortable out there so far. There's a high drive to deep center field. That ball is tagged. The wind is blowing that way. Stone goes back, and he makes the catch, a tremendous catch falling against the wall. Evan Stone. Left-hand batter waits the pitch. There's a bouncer towards right field, and it escapes the glove of a diving Cole Messina at first base. Short lead off first. Pitch on the way. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Payoff pitch, strike three call, and Messina didn't think much of it. Was about to take off his. Was not made. Kevin Sweeney, yeah. the home plate umpire, and there's a base hit in the left field on a 91 mile an hour fastball. Good job, Brewer, going the other way. Hit it right where it was pitched. Pitch on the way, runner going. It's up high. Throw down is not in time. Stolen base for Dylan Brewer. Too much anymore. And that one's just a little bit low for ball four. Pitch on the way. Swing and a miss. He blows it by him at 91. He struck him out. And the side. Here's Honeycutt. Got to be careful with this guy. Pitch. He shows bunt, and it is a beauty. You can forget that one. Be Becker won't even do anything but stick it in his pocket. It's just a great baseball play by a really savvy uh, like preseason All-American. Pitch on the way. Swing and a miss. He struck him out with a high hard one at 90. Pitch on the way. He's bunting, and it's up towards the first base side. Toss over. They're not going to get him. That is a perfect bunt from the Gamecock standpoint. Left-handed pitcher, so you want to bunt it towards the right side of the infield because the pitcher is leaning the other way when he follows through. Pretty good one over there. Swing and a miss. He throws it by him up in the zone at 92. 2-0 pitch. There's a high drive. That ball is tagged towards center, but it looks like the center fielder, Honeycutt, has a beat on it on the warning track for out number three. And the one, two on the ground, deep in the hole to short. Wimmer backhands it, will not have a chance to get up and throw it, however. And that'll go down as an infield single for Castanazzi. Reddies and delivers the 0-2. Called strike three. Perfect pitch. Not sure what Cook was looking for. It wasn't that. And four-pitch walk issued to Lee Croy as the fastball lands high. 2-2 pitch. Braswell puts it in play. Off to short. Colby Wicker Wilkerson underhands it to second as he goes the short route, and he is responsible for all three assists. And no score in this one. Tar Heels and Gamecocks meeting for the 104th time, dating back to 1903. Raylan Wimmer tried to backhand that in the hole. He couldn't do so. And this is another two-out hit, as has become the theme tonight. Yeah, it really has. That was pretty well handled. Took a while, though. Took a while also for Jonathan French to discover where that ball had gone as it bounces off the plate, then his glove. It... He drives it to center field. Evan Stone retreating. Looks playable. He'll camp out and bring it in. White stripes, blue, um, excuse me, white pants and blue pinstripes, says. 2-2 Two -two pitch. Called strike three. Got him on the outside corner. A tired. This one hit right up the middle. It could be two. Wilkerson takes it himself to second base, then fires across on a line, and it retires the side. French first at second. The one two swing and a miss. Jerzenbeck fools him. That cutter at 88 miles an hour came in on him. First pitch out to center field. Long run. Stone, will he get there? I don't think so. It was a high ball, but it came down rather quickly from Frick, and it drops in. I'm looking in this booth. I don't see one. Oh. Trying to end it here. This one softly hit just outside the circle of dirt around home plate. Jonathan French trots a couple of feet to the left down the third base line, fields it, gets it across in time. Now the 3-1, low and out. Second walk issued by Mateus. Mateus exhales, delivers. This one ripped right up the middle, but right to the shoestring of Wilkerson. On the line, he throws back to first and doubles off Petrie. 
The pitch. There's a shot fair inside the third base bag. That'll be the first extra base hit of this game. Dylan Brewer hustles it in. And it's a two out double. Another two out base runner in this ball game. Alvarez just smashed that ball down the line. Pitch on the way. Right off the fist out there to Wimmer at short. He's got it for out number three. Pitch. Did he go too far? They appeal and they say he did. High fastball couldn't lay off. Pitch on the way. Swing and a miss and a low pitch on a changeup. Strikes him out. And two gone for, two gone for Carolina here. Pitch on the way. Way up high and back to the screen. So a two out walk, another two out base runner. Here it comes. There's a drive towards left field. Down towards the corner. It is a fair ball into the corner. Michael Braswell is going to try to score. Here comes the throw. It's off target. And the Gamecocks lead this game. One to nothing. Finally, somebody has scored. And the former Tiger, Jonathan French, does it with two outs. One nothing, Carolina. What would you just say, Tommy? We like him now. Yes, we do. French breaks through as Sandstorm begins here at Truist Field. And I must say, I think now that there is a Gamecock majority in this stadium because there are quite a few who are buried among that sea of Carolina blue to the left. Now they're all rising. They're wearing garnet, and they are loud. Pitch on the way. There's a line drive down the left field line. It is fair. In to score is Jonathan French. Evan Stone will easily stand at second with a double. That was a frozen rope to the corner. And the Gamecocks lead it two to nothing. Everybody out of the dugout loving it and celebrating Jonathan French as he comes in fired up. And Evan Stone back-to-back -back doubles. All of a sudden, this game has a much different feel to it. That one was smashed. And that's going to do it for the right-hander. Braylon Wimmer, 0 for 3, is going to be the next batter, but he will face another pitcher. 2-2 pitch. There's a bouncer to short. Boy, he has been busy. Wilkerson throws across, and he just got him by an eyelash. Drops the ball, but I think he had it long enough. Here comes the payoff. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Fastball at 92 down. That would have been ball four, I do believe. Pitch on the way. Right down the middle. Was guessing for something else. He struck him out. So a tough night for Horvath. Wind up. Pitch on the way. Strike three call on a slider. He struck him out, and he struck out the side. Pitch on the way. Breaking ball. There's a high drive towards left center field. Back to the wall is Alvarez, and it's off the wall. Going to be a stand-up double. Way up in the air for Casas. So lefty-lefty matchup or not, Gavin Casas goes to the opposite field. Pitch on the way. There's a chopper, a swinging bunt. Pitcher has it, throws, and he did not get him. So that one wasn't quite hit off the wall. A swinging bunt. He couldn't have rolled it out there any more perfectly. Pitch on the way. There's a bouncer to deep short. That'll get the run in. Throw to first base is not going to be in time. That's another infield hit for Carolina, the first hit of the night for Cole Messina. And by not striking out, boy, you just put the ball in play. Good things can happen. Shows bunt. Takes it down in the dirt and gets away from the catcher. Both runners will move up. Pitch on the way. Is a little bit inside for ball four. Didn't miss by much. There's a little looper in the right center field. It is going to be drop in for a hit. It's an RBI for Lee Coy. All the runners on the bases had to hesitate to make sure it wasn't going to fall in because Vance Honeycutt can catch just about anything out there. He needs to, but he felt really good with French and said that there's a shot to second. That could be two. The short for one on the first double play, so no run batted in for Braswell, but the Gamecocks, Messina crosses the plate with run number five. Right-hander stretches and fires. There's a looper over the shortstop's head, but it's not going to get over his head. It was high. He had to reach up for it, but, boy, that guy covers a lot of ground out there. That's Wilkerson. Pitch on the way. There's a bouncer in between hop. Lee Croy backs up, makes the play, and throws him out. Right-hand batter waits to pitch on the way. There's a bouncer to short. Wimmer's got it. Throws across. Out number two. Pitch. 
There's a high pop up into short left field. Dylan Brewer in fair territory makes the catch and tosses the ball into the stands, and the Gamecocks have won this one.